This week marks a prime time to book your summer vacation and the International Air Transport Association predicts a record 4.7 billion people will fly this year. And that means more travel nightmares than ever. Fox 31 problem solver Shell Turner is live with new details on airlines game plans. Shell. <laughs> well, think about that. Billions of people. But take a look behind me. Right now, it is pretty quiet out here. That will change. So travel experts say this is the time to play offense so you don't end up playing defense with the airlines over delays, cancellations, and lost luggage. Travel can be stressful. Definitely going through security. So we plan ahead. With a little one having lots of snacks, toys, seeing how bad traffic is. But with more people expected to crowd airports and planes in the coming months, consumer advocates warn we could all be in for a rough ride. Unfortunately, last year we saw a record number of complaints. Colorado Public Interest Research Group Executive Director Danny Katz tells the problem solvers, be strategic in how you book your flights. The kinds of flights you should be looking for would be morning flights and flights that don't have connections to the extent that you can make that happen. That just reduces the risk. Check refund policies if you're using a third party website to book your trip. Using a credit card can offer more protection when it comes to any disputes you may have with the airline. Download your airline's app to quickly communicate with customer service and get immediate notifications of cancellations and gate changes. Stay focused on the boards. Luggage nightmares can ruin a vacation. Make a move to keep yours safe by using a tracker, like an Apple AirTag or Tile. They sell these trackers online. You can find them between $14 or $28, some good trackers. If you put that in the bag, if the airline loses your bag, you at least know where it is. And document what's inside. Take a picture of everything right before you put it in your bag because you're entitled to a $3,800 worth of refunds if they lose your bag, but you're going to have to document it. In the event of a flight cancellation, Koperg says know your rights. No matter what reason a flight is canceled, you are entitled to a refund. Now, they may choose to rebook you, and if you accept that, then you are waiving that refund. Yeah, so in addition to that shopping list for the flip-flops and the sunscreen and everything else, you want to look up the number and the website for the U.S. Department of Transportation because if you have a complaint, you send it to them and they will require the airline to address it. Shaw Turner reporting live at kind of a quiet DIA tonight, Fox 31.